What's up YouTube? Welcome to Complete Tech Review. So today on the channel we are going to do a comparo between the new 2018 Bajaj Vikrant versus the old one and also I'm going to highlight the five new features which the 2018 Vikrant has to offer us. So without further ado let's start off. So to start off the front disc has a small cover at the um, top and this one is primarily for dust protection and also now the Vikrant gets a rear backrest. The side panel is now blackened, it was used to be silver color, now it is blackened and uh, the visual appeal of the vehicle is more or less the same apart from these five cosmetic changes. The uh, gear shift lever now it is not extended as it was earlier, now it gets a slightly different uh, model. However, the gearing system is the same, it is a 5-speed transmission vehicle. The rear backrest now has the uh, Vikrant logo embedded into it. It looks more stylish and it mainly solves the convenience perspective and it gives a good comfort to the pillion. Moving to the front, the handlebar mount is now black color whereas it was silver color in the earlier model and also the handle grip guard was silver color in the earlier model, now it is black color. The switch quality is uh, the same and it is one of the best in the 150cc segment. This comes with the HO feature as standard. Apart from these minor changes, the engine and the overall bike dimensions are more or less the same. This is powered by the 149.5cc engine which turns out a maximum PS of 12 PS at 7500 RPM and the maximum torque comes at 12.7 mm at uh, 5500 rpm the front suspension is a 33 mm unit and this gives the bike more macho and a muscular look and the rear is a twin shock nitrox gas fill suspension on the braking side the v15 engages a 240 mm unit disc unit and the rear is a 130 mm drum unit on the tire front, the front is a 90 by 90 18 inch tubeless tires and the rear is a 120 by 80 16 inch tubeless tire. The total fuel tank capacity is 13 liters and this also has the reserve which is 1.7 liters. As mentioned, the dimensions of the vehicle are more or less the same and it is having a length of 2040 mm and the width is 785 mm the overall ground clearance is 165 mm and the total curb weight of the vehicle is 137 kgs i hope you enjoyed the video if you do so please like and subscribe to my channel and this is kevin signing off till then ciao bye bye